you all for joining we are going of pandas here and we are going to data frame session from files taking data frame operations and then static alternate alternate right what are the indexing slicing condition subset all these are fine over so first we are going to find array operations how we are dealing with array Taylor universal function right so along with we are going to get well uh, code basic pandas lab code pandas code in my book all right so it will enable all these then get full a uh, simple uh, list which consists of a set of elements a and let's say here have the elements in the right list along with this we are creating my data operations my data and it's consider value have 10 20 and 30 elements here right so we are going to create array format also this array is np dot array right and my underscore right so this n from numpy so I, i'll allow me to port this numpy also number in python is just name so we converted just declared to list set of list and then we have provided the type casting why type casting the type casting my data is of list list data we are converting this list in array format this in dot array final final structure of my data right so let what you can see now this is, array has been right now i'm having one dictionary over and i'll define why we are creating so we have first as a then value of this is 10 here second is b here and the value of this third key here and the value of this right and along with this we are going it some um, we are going some um, well so what are the labels here right labels here as right so the label if I want to print my data, my data will have value comma my underscore data. In way, I'll try to print the data. have defined dictionary comma right printing all the values effectively builds my data and dictionary now we are going one c over here what is dot data is my underscore these right so we have to find the pandas first is and one a first is data frame then data frame consists of one dimension then we have one dimension have more than two or more than two so we will call it 
data frame. So here we have circle dimension or the vertical line, rows, circle column, call it. Have only such as, for example, have salary, right? So salary is a n k, right? Five k. 5k, 8k, and so on. Have salary column that go or these some just data. We are going to focus the mark sheet of any candidate. So, mark of any it will come of, of those and column both. So, in two dimensional, have subjects, have so number have marks quarter come so on the horizontal have sub math but in vertical column we will have session one session you can imagine this fix here about uh, candidate data a uh, three dimension now we are four classes a uh, four dimension come about come across but sir see called and format is dot c and equal to x right so whatever how defined along with x number by default it's two one but custom is index a pehle value pe jana chahiye b Now this is accommodated with customer, right? So this uh, fine or by default zero are now replaced. A B respect type is of all the put all the right. Now we can create another C. Dot of array over along with are going also see B for this X is equal array data. Also, we don't. Like format, but for array by default. Now, can I take S4 and the fourth S4 C and take dictionary over for oh, the of value. So we are going we are going to size as how you can output so this is how you can four different and all are all are pretty then we have the option called and as data frame so I had already kind of stuff. First is of one dimension salary by second of two dimension. 
Akshi of Delhi. Consists of and so in this half data, half met and. And in part, so then or have one twenty, and we. Tip it convert all these five rows four columns. So we will have five rows. Right now, if how it could be. Now, if it's like five only value, all these random values four only, including the second value. So we don't have five over. Have any twenty one till starting from one ninety. Part B. The score have defined. Still, so data frame. So the tables and what? Column I'll clean. Oh, I'll. For the subjective paint, F is on. Ali, you have seen. Oh, but F both are. Now, I'll provide the. Five cross row, five cross row column. So, will acquire or in put the index number. Index number will take by five column, five values here because we have one five five row. Why we have column heading four here because we have four columns here. Four columns. So in this case, I'll column in I'll take column column pattern. column heading equal into column is equal into column head column heading is by zero. Once it is 
a Quotes and I'll explain why I'm writing. Now coming to the so we are going to have to be. Have select for the name. Have slash line. Slash okay. right? Uh, like heading line. So how many words over here? Have written. Have written forty five line will. I'll hire well. Separate maybe in and the column head. Now, full label column head. So, what are logical columns? Okay. As And the mark one uh, uh, um, And in well, how many how we can of all but for this you can understand. So is all of you next part we have values of second what key now i name Here are going to
can see a for the respect a are set for main quantity but can you see programming or the theory how it it that option you are going out marketing it will have a more five third value Now, uh, ALC, but we have some. So, A, now we do A, A, traveling or eat or trade. Or have Apples, it so brain, apple. So the uh. Uh, excuse me. What what if uh, we uh, okay? Uh, I was asking uh, inside the uh, data frame, PD dot data frame. If I insert uh, columns is equal to columns. Column. Has What is a parameter? Oh, Corn. Yeah, right. Okay. All right. So we have. Uh, let me do column. Let me just column heading. Let me one have original data frame instead of the null values, right? So the next agenda we are going to discuss in the same code that is data frame can be created reading directly from CSV or Excel, right? So where this shield is located? Let me check in my Jupyter book. So cut F and you type dot csv we have any CSV? Yeah, i have 61 csv in my um, jupyter node really strict, right so let me go through customer csv first csv i found in my uh, sheet so customers dot csv copy this and then we are going to this customers dot csv panda and are having third data frame f3 and p dot uh, then how this customers dot the frame have an the frame now have any output it's not data frame it's not going to create the data frame rather it's it is csv so for this we have read 
HSV file, we are not initializing our file type of mistake. So we have HSV read from the local machine. So the deployment of this reading data is just p dot read. And uh, can I print dot head? If I'll get the uh, certain data set, so I'll go this. Otherwise, I'll change. So we have customer's name and customer four in two different columns. It's very expensive. We have only two columns. We can have more values. So okay, let me check another CSV file where we have built. Okay. Okay, so I'll take cardio elco SV available for me. Copy this, copy and okay, copy this here over if three head. So, oh. Okay, let me file height home size output okay out oh having one all the columns are clear Killer type transmission. You can see the set can have more than column and more words over. Now we are going to get or the carrot more value. So we have DF4 which is going to if dot Excel sheet. Suppose we have Excel data set are going to that kind of so we are going to search dot xls x right so have first second whole data then rotate e have r o dot xls x right so this is going to edit this Finally, dot head. Then you can see material description, road called family, road called procedural family, supply chain, and we have 44 columns over. So, this is very huge data set. Site route, ship here. This Excel sheet might have more data set as we are expecting, right? So, so we can have now this. this entire excel or csv file or any other text file is now converted in same format data frame now we are going to quick check for these methods what are these methods let's say df3 for this df3 we have tail okay so you can see you can go last five records by default last five records Suppose we want to check another method, method is called sample, right? So this is going to show only a sample, a record randomly picking from the. If I run this in command one more time, it will random sample. If I'll run more the uh, same command time, so it will show values a screen. Second command we have f3 dot info. So this info is all about the null values. What are the uh, how many those records we have? Four zero. What are the column names? The type of the respective column object is for uh, categories values and integer sixty four for float and integer 
sorry integer 64 is for integer value and wherever we have float 64 we will have float value so as of now in this sheet we have only four integer 64 and five categories right so category have something uh string value something name something a diesel annual right so if you take the uh, the statistic property so we will have type so with this describe function have all the descriptive value for the numerical column this is it so we have only four numerical columns so can you see the six or four so for the four numerical columns it's maximum minimum percentile standard deviation their average value and their count we have 4040 records this is showing value right so this is all about the statistic part and we can see statistic is important words being very important role so we are having this introduction section and auto calculator pandas library if you want to transpose star dot transpose entire rows and columns so you can see now this count standard deviation are shown and in rows we have all the column values right you can drive this certain right right suppose have here or let's say i want to take this sailing price right so for this sailing price i'll have df3 column puts sailing price then we have mean take the mean of this column can you see whole mean of entire available values for the sailing price only right so you take another attribute of this particular numerical instead of you can check the standard so this is standard value can use statistic test test another form here yeah? then we can check the variance of this variance is high for this column right you can see the term called minimum out of this twenty thousand so similarly take the maximum value out of this column so you don't need manually or performing some function pandas or any data frame right for applying the same function for this you will find the value of all the medical so this is the shortcut you can find the column value or you can find the column x number Okay, so let's come back to the fixing, slicing columns of a data part. So, write some, write int value column, right? Column name is this one, if name. So, we don't have any, yes? So, I'll have to check if f4 or attribute. Have oh we have D have name file check and okay. T another column part of 
M column and then we have effective name and the okay. M column right but would see would see partition here column here of the right so separated part so they have separate values right so this would just column name so can go for some allocation part also right just if dot look table location for select So we don't have any error because we have if dot i l. So what is if dot l c l o c method? Can so we are going to select if dot l o c. So which is just selecting that that c columns l row, right? Can we select multiple rows? Yes, with the help of l o c function loc method can extract two columns or two more than two columns also in double square right so we can accessing those only and see right now can we this star i loc i loc index position here and method and we are using some index number so in the LOC we cannot text number wherever I L O C can use text number it is I I L O C I L O C one two they are select two row right so one two third column and here we are select one two one two me so one two second and third hence we are having third records over right so this is how we can multiple values at single time data uh, using this uh, uh, this indexing value and this star value, right? So you can use ILOC. This is the most frequent task with the when do ILOC, LOC. So it's uh, just selecting the rows on the basis of index number or the name. You are using name, number of rows, and column name. Then we will use LOC. If we are using X number, then use I LOC. Right? So this was the differentiation between particular methods. Second term we have conditional subsetting. Right? So what is the conditional subsetting here? So conditional subsetting and let have DF four and the column name something and have some condition right so let me print first f4 dot how this did. this letter looks like this production family right can we have the got head have head yes have this okay so can I take F2 and the apple column? Take this F2 and with apple column, I need data set greater than 39. So it's showing two values. So this first row is false, value is true value is true because this 30 is a uh, false condition for this one less than 39 second and third 40 and 74 are true for this one which means right if i'll rate uh, like assign some condition then uh, try to end 
So you can see, but you can see output of this where it is right. But if I can assign the same condition inside the F2 square bracket and assign the condition. Now, can you see it is showing only two records Apple, which is satisfying this condition greater than 39. So, you can see inside the Apple, only conditions are true than 39. If I write greater than 40, so only one row will be selected because this 74 inside the Apple column, 74 is the only value which is satisfying this condition. If Apple greater than 40, right? Now, I need more values, more conditions. So, what I will do? So, df then df is greater than, let's say, round around the column, right? And I'll take the another value, put the end operator and paste over here. So, square bracket, only condition will be. So, inside the orange, Inside the orange, uh, how many uh, I need only greater than right? So, greater than 30, we have only two first value. You can see only one rows are depicted because we have 74 greater than 39, 30, 74, and 40, and out of these, we have orange column is greater than 60 right so i'll write 60 and 9 right greater than equal to 60 so we will have two two conditions two records here because now this is equal to 6 also so now this female is also satisfying the second condition so now we are printing values right this is all about the condition right so any 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 doubt okay so the second part we have very important here we use in place is equal to true to make changes reflected on the original all the value place inside the value. so let me write this here so here we have df dot sort value right so we have df2 f2 dot sort value so, but see by braid. I want to sort the value by braid R E, and this will be replaced original sheep also. Let me run this code and let me print it out. F two. So, can you see male, female, other are just ten twenty five. Okay, so we have 30. Okay, so banana. Can we check for bananas? Can you see sorting values 12, 19, 17, 71. But originality, originally 12, 71, 19. So sequence has been male, female, others. Here we have male, others, and female six. Which is the sort which is going to perform sort values according to the banana column and also replacing within the original location, right? So, this is responsibility of in place when we need orange originality uh, changes, when we need something uh, a positional uh, occurrence there, then we can search in place is equal to two. otherwise, only Jupiter impression will be here original replacement happened okay so any doubt this was the all about the data frames and basics of the data frame uh, the, uh, basics of the pandas pandas library and if you want to check more functionality go to the official site of pandas we have dedicated sites of pandas
for pandas library in link go for pandas documentation here we have official website pandas.pydata.org you can access more documentation there guide developer guide right source repository and getting started working with part pandas packages overview started how to create plots in the pandas everything just been over here go through but first and foremost must have idea about basic fundamental operation this they are the building blocks are milestone to understand these complex graphs they are reading tabular data but in either way in the different ways right if you will have the basic idea of the plot category so definitely you can understand this uh, official uh, document the references right that would be easier if you, first can you see they are also using short values by age but now you know tightening is the data frame sort value is method which is just sorting the uh, all the values and by what is by according to a's column of this entire syntax and head and it's doing by default five records on the screen not all the values on the screen on the horizon so this is all about entire statement over here so you must break down entire statement and elaborate more about the data column and then only you can uh, illustrate more about the official document otherwise that would be very tricky gory and out of the box that you are not getting get rid of entire value so 